interesting fishes. Many people would like to place this motion picture at home. A glass tank, a filter, fit on time and change water periodically. Many beginners usually start with this basic concept and fed the first and second fishes quite easily. When fishes species and quantity became more and more, some fishes died suddenly. No any new fishes survived. For marine fishes, commonly referred to saltwater fishes, such mystery death of new fishes always happened in one month. Since this episode, I will tell the basic and advanced knowledge of aquarium design and equipments, as well as some disease treatments for marine fishes, corals, and some other marine creatures, so that everyone can keep marine living creatures successfully. The pH value of pure water is 7. The home use tap water has pH value very close to 7. Treat it as neutral. The pH value of river water is 6 to 7. It is weak acidic. Ocean has a different ecology environment, having more kinds of marrow and chase elements. The pH value of seawater is 8 to 8.4. It is alkaline. Different pH values in different sea area because they have different elements concentration controls the pH value in this range almost all kinds of fishes can adapt it generally the pH value of seawater is quite stable unless the water quality drops it changes to acidic the pH value decreases. Carbonate hardness pH value is one of water properties. Higher of pH value, the water is considered to be harder. In oppositely, sulfur. The pH value of seawater is between 8 and 12. Hard water. Fresh water is below 8. Soft water. Every marine creature absorbs required elements from water. Fishes get nutrition by eating food mainly. They take less elements from seawater. Therefore, fishes in fish tank don't decrease cage value very much. During change tank water, it replenishes elements to the tank water. The cage value increases again. If there are many hard corals in the fish tank, which need to absorb much elements from the seawater, the catch value will drop to even lower than 8, so as to affect the ecology. Too high or too low of pH or catch value is harmful to the base. For example, shrimps, crabs, etc. If the pH or cage value stays at the wrong value for a week or more, the invertebrates will die. Creatures have bad bone, for example, fishes, can injure in the seawater with too high or too low of pH or cage value for a long time before they have any life threatening. From the stronger fishes, they may even survive. Hence, beginners of keeping marine creatures should start with raising marine fishes. Well, why are the pH and cage value too high or too low? The popular reason of too high is too much chemical sea salt dissolved in fresh water during changing fish tank water. It is the human cause problem to change water to too much alkaline and harder. The cage value is too low because some marine creatures 
excluding fishes, absorbed various kinds of elements from the tank water without any replenishment. The reasons for pH value dropped to eight or lower. It is because creatures' fins and leftover foods dissolved into water before separated by filtration coated. The water had been dirtied for a long time without any improvement. The water became more acidic at last. Such water condition is defined as worse because dissolved fins and foods produce the colorless and tasteless poison, which is deadly to marine creatures. Before the poison concentration is enough to decrease the pH value. It can kill fishes as well as other creatures in a night or five to six hours. That's why beginners often ask, the pH value was normal, but why even the healthy fishes raised since first day died without any symptom? Put in a new fish, died again. This was because the fish tank had already been accumulating such deadly, colorless, and tasteless poison. Before talking about how to remove this unseen poison, it is necessary to have the basic concept of nitrogen cycle. In next episode, I will introduce N-cycle.